So today is January the 8th and a full week on the snake, uh, yeah, on the Keto Universe diet, snake diet. No, I think I'll go with the Keto Universe. It's, dark, it's, it's pretty much, I mean Keto, I'm doing all the different Ketos, including the snake diet, even though it's a Keto diet. Um, and this is the week, so yeah, we're now on the Keto Universe diet, not to come fuddle people, because people get come fuddled. I'm one of those people to get come fuddled, just to get me on comfortable and stuff. Yeah, so I'm on the Keto Universe diet, in which this week I have been mainly on OMAD. I did one day which was too mad, uh, that's because, and uh, Monday to Thursday, I had steak and veg, and I bought it one of the days, you had the steak in the um, afternoon and the veg at night, and then on a Friday, I had steak, you know, I had a mix of veg, which had steak in it, and Mixed steak and mixed veg. Yeah, that was on Friday. And on a Saturday, I had a full chicken, a bit of cream. Um, yeah. Um, a little bit of a, a tiny bit of salad and a bit of like beef. So, yeah, I think that was, that was too much, but the meal were actually a meal, if you know what I mean. It was more like a snack. Um, and last night, I had. Six eggs, twelve bacon, and some prawns. Uh, probably shouldn't have had them, but I found out that eggs eh, just, just go straight for human nowadays. So, uh, yeah, oh, you see, without a super strong cheese, uh, uh, so like that. And um, I am knackered, me. But oh, my sleep hasn't been too good. But I'm determined to get up, you know. Right, so this is here. Um, January, waiting at 334.8 pounds. We are now January the 8th. And even though it says eight days, it's my first week. I don't know, it's like so, so uh, crazy witchcraft to me, that is. Let's have a look. What's, what's going on? Oh, 323.8. Wow, I've done something somewhere that's not too good. 323.8. Oh crap. Uh, 323.8, was it? Yeah, you know, you know. Oh. Yeah. I thought that was a different number, that was 3, um, 26 up there, so I thought that was like 321 or something, but it's like 326, so I've lost some weight. Um, I did have a full chicken and some cream, like, so, and I did have 10 slices of bacon last night. I probably shouldn't have had 10 with 6 eggs and some prawns, but you, you know what I mean, like, saying some afterwards, yeah. Uh, Back in a minute. So how cool is that? Oh, bam, I'm back by the way. Um, I've lost 11 pounds in my first week. I'm actually uh, really good about, uh, happy about that. I was actually hoping for a 10 pound loss a week. When it just came up down 323, I thought, I haven't actually lost that much weight, but I actually have gone over the, what I was wanting to lose. I always switch just the camera around, I think. I'm going to table this for this Google Pixel. It's over there. Software on it's bad, bad. I can't even update shit. If you can't update a phone, I'm going to switch to update fucking planes and shit. You know what I mean? It's well dodge. Anyway, so, also along with this diet, I'll also... So I've been doing all my keto, bad for once when I did all bad, too bad keto. I also went to the gym on Monday, 
on Tuesday. And I all, and I went to the gym on yeah, I went to the gym on Monday. I went to the gym on Tuesday on a Thursday. And um Yeah. And it looks like I do like eight machines. I do a set of twelve on each machine. I try to lift to failure but unfortunately when I'm doing that with twelve reps, it doesn't feel like I'm doing anything. So even when I come out at the end of it, I feel like, oh, well, I haven't actually done anything. And then I don't really feel it. So I'm changing it from 12 to 20. Just to give me that extra eight, because so it feels like I'm just warming myself up before actually doing it properly. I think that's... But I'm not sure if it's the best thing to do, because I've only just started doing it. But that's what I'm going to do. It's only an extra eight reps. Hopefully I'll start feeling it and feel like I'm doing it for weight. Um, yeah, I'm really tired, like, proper tired. It's my own fault. I was playing Herbstone till four o'clock in the morning and then I had to be up at half eight. You know, I, I, was, uh, I should have went to sleep, you know. Oh, I've been having some mad dreams as well. I had a dream about dying on Saturday night, which was a bit mad. And then I had this dream here, I was, uh, I was having a shit in my dream. Woke up, and I haven't shit the pet, so that was lucky. So yeah, so this is me, the first week on keto. My dreams, I've stuck to it properly, no cheating or anything. I've done some where I've got over 24 hours a day because I did a couple of days in the afternoon and then the one last I did in the afternoon. I did like at nine o'clock at night, which was last night. So I went a little bit uh, longer. I like a week ago, 26, 29. Well, I should have just known how to buy that. Yeah, I did like 29 fasting hours before I ate, and that was ye uh, yesterday. So. so it's not looking good. I'm on my diet. I'm, you know, it took me ages to get to do this, and I've lost 11 pounds in my first week, which is wonderful. I'm changing the name from snake diet to keto diet because I'm getting advice from everywhere. Uh, so Cole Robinson, Dr. Berg, Dr. Eckberg, Thomas DeLauer, that Dr. Boss, I, I think, who does the sardine diet. You know, I'm listening to them all and the ones that, like, disappear, like, for two years and they never come back. But, um, yeah, those types of people. So uh, everything, basically, I'm using every bit of knowledge I can and then re-watching the videos so that I forget a lot and see where it takes me. So that's my first week of the Keto Universe done in which I've lost £11, which I think is really good. This is me, the Mtronia one, on the way to success.